morning, everybody. This is uh, Lucas of the TPC channel with our exclusive client, Joe Whitlow. Hi there. <laughs> Joe, before we get into Night of the Creeps, uh, let's talk about Porky's. You were 16 years old when that happened. 16. Was that your first movie? Yeah. So just yeah. how the hell were you able to get that role? Well, um, I had an agent, and I, had, I was living in Miami. Mm -hmm. And, of course, it filmed in Miami Beach. But... I had a modeling agency, so I had already been, you know, doing modeling and, and commercials. Mm -hmm. I had done um, a few national commercials, orange juice, Coca-Cola, stuff like that, and I went on the interview, and um, I got it. <laughs> so. I mean, did you think it was going to be that big of a cult movie? Oh my gosh, no. Yeah. I didn't. That was, it was, no. yeah. But I went to a private school. And um, they loved it. I mean, <laughs> you know, the publicity that they got right. was amazing. And my mom owned a bunch of five and dime stores and a restaurant called Fiddles. And and so she got a lot of publicity oh, as well. Yeah. I remember, I haven't had my coffee yet. <laughs> I can't say that word. But um, yeah, so it was it was really cool. and. And Bob Clark kind of took me under his wing, and um, I met so many people yeah. after that. I flew up to New York. I was only 16, so of course my mom, me, went with me. Um, and I met Wilhelmina. Um, she wanted to meet me. She was friends with Bob. And he just, you know, talked a lot about me and my, my mom was like, she's only 16, she's not moving to New York, <laughs> you know? So I had to wait <laughs> until I graduated. Night of the Creeps, big, yeah. big cult movie. Um, so many things we could, we could talk about this movie. But oh, yeah. the, uh, and we've talked to Jason and Alan about this in previous interviews, but the, uh, the creeps, uh -huh. like, <laughs> What is your experience with them? Because I was told some are rubber and some were, um, I, I don't know, there was so many different one with like a trash bag, I guess, but what was your- They were rubber. All of them were rubber? Yeah. Did you go? Okay. I think, I mean, if yeah. I only saw rubber, because it had to wiggle. So they said that you, you said you took one home. I did. And it's disintegrated since. It disintegrated. <laughs> it was in a box and I, I opened up the box one day because I was just going through some stuff mm -hmm. and I went, oh my gosh, my creep is gone. <laughs> <laughs> it was very sad. Well, oh, it, what was your, do you have any stories that you can say um, that most people wouldn't know about with Night of the Creeps? Oh my gosh. Wow. Um. <laughs> ooh, <laughs> I stories um mostly involving jason and steve that we could never find because they were always at frat parties <laughs> when we were ready to get back to filming um goodness well while i was the oh so the time in the shed mm -hmm. That wasn't acting on Jason's part. I accidentally pulled the trigger on the flamethrower. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're like, whoa! <laughs> um, I wasn't real careful, I guess. <laughs> I, you know, did the thing with the shotgun, and it, the, the um, thing came out and hit me in the face, and that was not good. <laughs> I went down. Um... You know, just little funny things like that. Um, and, you know, the scene where I took off my my shirt. because Well, well actually, I took off my bra, I think. Because <sighs> Fred didn't want to show booby because he knew I didn't want to. Right. So I said, but it looks so stupid putting on, you know, my nightgown with my bra and <laughs> people just don't do that. 
So he cleared the whole entire set for me, which was, was really great. sweet. Yeah, it was sweet. And Jason and Steve will always tell you they were hiding under the bed. <laughs> <laughs> but they weren't. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, it was just such a great movie. And we were all so much like family yeah. from the very beginning. We all got along so good. Yeah. Jason, you know? dude, it's, it's, it's a great cast. It's yeah, really great cast. I know. And Tom, being older, he just fit right in with us. Yeah. You know? And, you know, I think. That, that was a huge part of Night of the Creeps success. Oh, for uh, yeah. Is is you could tell that we were just so in tune with each other. Yeah. You know, the chemistry was just all there it, with all of us. It felt like it during the movie. I think that that, that helps some movies succeed for sure. Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Mm -hmm. So Jill, thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> Lucas. Thanks guys.